सो हेयर आई विल ट्राई टू प्रोवाइड यू अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इन्फॉर्मेशन फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू फॉर द अपकमिंग डेज ऑफ जोसा काउंसलिंग डेट इज एज यू ऑल नो देर विल बी टू मॉक अलॉटमेंट सो वट इज दिस मॉक अलॉटमेंट वट आर द कॉन्सिक्वेंसेज ऑफ दिस मॉक अलॉटमेंट एंड वट यू कैन टेक फ्रॉम दिस मॉक अलॉटमेंट एंड वट विल बी द बेनिफिट ऑफ इट so everything i will discuss here so if you are first to my channel please try to subscribe to the channel so you will be getting all the update about josa counseling csep counseling other counseling other inter exam as well in the same channel so please try to subscribe so first question is what is the use of this mock allotment so the use of this mock allotment is just to inform you what you can get in the first round but that is not 100% sure because after mock allotment lots of student will do the changes and your allotment in first round will be affected by that that is if other student will change the choices accordingly the effect will be on the cut off of first rounds so after mock allotment there will be lots of change in the choice filling of lots of student so that's what i would like to inform you secondly that is after mock allotment you will able to change it and it is like a warning that you if you will put like this choices you will get uh, you will get this or that or even you can't get anything so after getting the mock allotment you can reorder your choices add some more choices or delete some choices if you want you can do that is for second mock allotment and after second mock allotment also it is first mock allotment is on 18 so on 18 19 you will able to change it and on 20 you will get the second mock allotment after that up to 21st you will able to change the choices again so one second i would like to inform you this is the trial allotment that is mock allotment this is not the original allotment but similar type of thing you will be getting in the first round second round it is obviously the allotment will be different but the way of allotment will be same that is only one choice among your choices whatever you have filled based on your rank and based on your priority they will provide you that's why the choice filling is very important once you do mistake there and after 21st you will not able to change the choices any time up to the 6th round obviously for csep counseling you will able to do the fresh choice filling but here you will have to do the uh, counseling process very carefully it is choice filling and also the decision making after each round once you do any type of mistake there no one will listen to you later and you will waste your rank that's why it is very advisable to do it very carefully if you have all the experience you can do it by yourself otherwise you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number there is a nominal charge for that once you register i will be guiding you completely for all the process up to admission is done so that you will not do any type of mistake and i will be providing you the personal choice filling list after discussing with you it is not like i will provide you and you will blindly trust that i will be discussing with you based on your interest and goal that you want to achieve after 4 years i will be doing the choice filling for you and also the decision making so this was the information regarding the mock allotment that you should keep in your mind because mock allotment is also a very important process in the counseling process so that you will able to rectify your mistake if you have done anything now so hope you get this information very useful so please try to subscribe the channel so that you will be getting all the update in the future days as well thanks